What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Daily Diver here, back again guys with another episode. I hope all of you had an awesome day. Thank you all so much for tuning back in. If you guys are new to my channel and tuning in for the first time guys, really quick, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button because we do new episodes of Dumpster Diving every single night guys. This is a lot of fun. I look for all of you to come with me and see what kind of amazing treasures we can all find together guys. So um, I'm over here. Oh, if you missed last night's episode, please go check that out. Huge jackpot. Definitely worth watching. I'll leave a link right on up there. Also, there will be a link inside the description. Definitely worth checking out, guys. So, I'm over here, I am at the um, Barnes & Noble dumpster, guys. And sadly, I already looked through everything for the most part, pretty much. Yeah, I don't think there's anything inside of here. That box over there was sitting right here, and I just threw it against the wall over there because I was kind of mad because I thought there was something in it. But anyway, I'm over here. I'm at Barnes. just figured I'd start the video over here. But this is like the third dumpster for tonight, guys. Not having a whole lot of luck so far yet. Not a big deal. Still go to a bunch of more dumpsters, guys. So anyway, I did go to, uh, I'm not, I don't really remember everywhere I went. Pretty much went to a couple of dumpsters already. Haven't really found anything yet, guys. So let's go ahead and let's get right into this episode and see what kind of amazing stuff we can find. <laughs> Guys, we are over here at the. Um, I already looked through here just a little bit, and um, I can already tell there's nothing inside of here. But just to give you guys a quick little update. I know I go here every now and again. Check out all the flipping food, guys. There's always so much food inside of here. It, it's seriously insane. Look at all that. Like it literally goes all the way down to the bottom. Such a flipping waste, guys. Tons of food there. Another humongous box. Who knows what's over here? Like, there's just so much stuff. It's really, really sad. Definitely could donate some of this, but I guess it is what it is. I just wanted to show you guys. And there is another dumpster right behind here. And um, there's, like, a bunch of, like, onions and stuff inside of that one. A lot of produce is usually what I see inside of here. But sometimes we definitely hit a jackpot, like, as far as, like, household, like, merchandise and stuff like that. So it's definitely worth checking here every now and again. But anyway, really, there's nothing over here. I just figured I'd show you guys all this flipping produce and all kind of like crazy food. Just boxes and boxes of stuff, guys. So anyway, we're going to leave here. Guys, there is um the tarp is right down there. I don't know if it's a little bit blurry. Probably not going to be able to see it. There is the tarp there where we found an amazing jackpot last night at. So I'm going to go ahead and go in there. But as you guys know, if you've been watching my channel for a while now. um Anyway, here's the other dumpster focus but anyway guys like i said if you've been watching my channel for a while now um the dumpster is right over there on the side and that's where their back door is i don't know you guys probably can't see it but anyway i'm not going to film over there i'm going to check around there because they sometimes they sit like shopping carts full of stuff back there and there is a gigantic dumpster where we found all the amazing stuff last night at so i'm going to go over there and i'm going to share with you guys what i find but i'm not going to film inside of there because i don't want to be loud and i don't want to get caught because they do have their own security people guys so i'm going to head over to Target now and i'll be right back all right guys i just left and i'm inside my car right now um there was, sadly there was nothing inside the big dumpster that they have back there but like i said they do put shopping carts back there and there was like a bunch of like broken pasta bottles and like uh, pasta sauce and this was laying inside of a cart that was next to that cart there was two carts back there and this was laying inside of here this is a french press it's actually really really awesome i always wanted one of these and um anyway it's really really nice and there's nothing wrong with it at all i don't see anything wrong with it um but like i said that's pretty much it that over there at target but um the dumpster it looks like it's going to be there for a while it's been there for like three days now but like i said sadly there's nothing left inside there just the same stuff from last night guys so that's pretty much it over at target go ahead and i'm going to move on to the next dumpster all right, guys, over here at the local office supply store. They're very popular. You guys know exactly who they are. I'm not going to say their names in my episodes anymore for certain reasons or another. But anyway, guys, there's definitely some stuff in here. First of all, check out this flipping storage bin. And really quick, guys, I just want to say I'm, I'm not going to go through the stuff inside of here. There's a huge bag of stuff right here. It looks like probably full of returns hopefully there's some amazing stuff in there but i'm not going to go through it here because the security guard is still here right now he usually doesn't leave till like midnight and it's still a little bit early so um i just wanted to give you guys a quick look definitely a gigantic storage bin that is flipping amazing even if i only found this these things are these things are awesome to have because they're extremely expensive and there's another storage bin right there and there's another um some kind of item inside of there. I have no idea. We're, like I said, we're going to go. I'll probably take it back to the house. And I will go through it there. Um, just because I don't want to get the stuff confiscated. Because if he comes back here and he, he catches me back here. He is definitely going to make me put the stuff back. 
inside the dumpster and I do not want that to happen guys so like I said over here at the office supply store definitely a little bit of a jackpot I have no idea what's inside the bag guys and right over there um is TJ I already checked that really quick absolutely nothing in there um you guys saw last night they have all those like um women's high heel shoes they completely destroyed i'm going to take all this stuff home and we'll go through the bag hopefully there's some amazing stuff in here guys and I'm, we're still going to go to more dumpsters so i'll be right back it's time guys check it out they tried to hide the bag from me all these boxes were like stuffed over top of this bag and it was stuck underneath everything and they tried to hide it from me i think guys humongous humongous return bag check it out let's just grab one thing out of here Headphones, so much amazing stuff. This is going to be an epic jackpot bag. We do have that bag from the office supply store. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to pull this out of here. We'll go through it at my house just a little bit easier. Um, um, I mean, actually, the dumpster really isn't that full because usually I'll just go inside of here and I'll take everything out on camera inside the dumpster. But I don't know. Sometimes it's a little bit easier to take it home. Plus, we have the epic bag. Hopefully, it's epic. Um, we still have a bag from the office supply store. So I think I'll just pull that out of here. We'll go through both of the bags at my house. This one is going to be flipping amazing. Check how big it is, guys. Let's go ahead and we'll pull this out of here. I don't think... I don't know. Let's check really quick. Yeah, I really don't feel... What is this? Hold on. There's um something over there I didn't even notice. Like I said, I have not even pulled this bag out of here yet. But it looks like it's the same thing that this is. Whoa. That is flipping awesome. It is an ultimate candle making kit. Something definitely new from guys we have never found before. And it looks like there's another one over there. And I don't know. Maybe we should go. Maybe we should go to the other side really quick. Let's go check the other side. All right, guys. I just checked the other side. And luckily, we did because guess what? Look at this box. I just pulled out of here. Humongous flipping jackpot of posters. So many of them, guys. Oh, my God. I don't even know. Like, I saw emoji ones. Those are freaking amazing looking. I don't know. It's probably at least 100 posters here. So, I was not even going to check the other side. Because, like I said, they were all this stuff was covered in cardboard boxes. So, it looks like they were trying to hide them from us. But, we found them, guys. Huge jackpot. Um, like I said, we'll go through all this stuff. To, um, just like the huge, huge bag right over there. We'll go through all this stuff. And then, we'll go through the, uh, the bag from over there at the um, office supply store. We'll go through all of it at the same time, guys. So, we're going to pack this up. We're going to go ahead and head home. We're to go through all this amazing stuff huge jackpot here guys i'll be right back all right guys we are back at my house guys it is cold outside let me know if it is cold where you live i don't know what happened it went from like being like a little bit cold or just like a little bit warm actually to like cold all of a sudden just like that but anyway got the little fireplace running guys it is freezing outside though anyway let's go ahead i got all the stuff already set up over there to be honest with you guys it is the next day um when i'm gonna be filming us going through all this stuff. I was just super tired when we got home. You could say hi to the puppy really quick. You make it a mess right there. Eating all your... Why do you have two bones, Maya? Say hi to everybody. Hi! Alright guys, anyway, let's go ahead. Like I said, I already got everything already set up. Um, Look at all these flipping posters. Oh my god. Freaking jackpot on posters, guys. Huge bag for five. Then we got the couple stuff from the um office supply store. So let's go ahead. Um, Let's go ahead and let's get into this really quick, guys. All right, so first things first, obviously we do have this awesome flipping tote that did come from the dumpster and it came really in handy because this bag was starting to tear and that bag from five, humongous bag, look how big it is, flipping jackpot over here, but um, this gigantic tote came from um, the office supply store as well and it definitely came in handy. I just stuck the huge bag from five out of it because it definitely was tearing, um, really, really heavy bag guys. So anyway, let's go ahead, let's get into this first. So like I said, we got the tote as well extremely awesome definitely going to keep that for sure and then i did uh, stick this and we'll go over this one more time this is um you guys know like i told you already this is from the target dumpster actually it wasn't even in the dumpster like i told you earlier it was in a shopping cart like sometimes they put shopping carts like out back of the building um the dumpster isn't always there guys they um i know you guys leave comments saying well my uh target has dumpsters that are like or against the wall like connected to the building mine are too but sometimes they just put gigantic dumpsters out back when they're like doing remodeling or i have no idea why but every now and again they do it and maybe they just do it more in my area for some reason but anyway we did find this flipping what is this called again this is a French press. That's exactly what it is. I have no idea why it was just sitting in there, guys. Like I told you, there was just like a bunch of broken stuff inside of a shopping cart. And um, this, um, there was another shopping cart full of like cardboard. And this was just sitting in there. 
absolutely flipping awesome. Like I told you, I always wanted one of these. Really cool. If you guys don't know what they are, you pretty much just put your coffee down in the bottom. Um, well, you take this whole thing out. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, but you take this whole thing out. Oh, it did come with a coffee scoop as well. So I'm just going to wash it up. There's like, it's brand new guys still has like the, the instructions or whatever in the world that is at the bottom. But anyway, you put your coffee down at the bottom. I'm sure you guys know exactly what this is. And then, um, you let it uh, sit there for a while and then you, this whole thing just comes off and then you press this down and then you pretty much just pour your coffee. That's pretty much it guys. Definitely really cool. Never tried coffee out of it. I definitely like coffee a lot. So I'm really excited to try that. I'm not really sure how much it was. Don't see a price tag, but I'm sure it was like. I don't know, probably like at least 20 bucks, maybe even more, guys. So anyway, we got this huge bag. Not huge, not as big as that one, but definitely a cool bag over here from the office supply store. Um, I think I'll just go ahead. Let's get into it while it's inside of this tote. Just want to make a big mess. Did not look in here at all, so I have no clue what's in here. It could be a bunch of nothing. Have no idea. Got some papers. Try to open this up a little bit more. Um, cardboard. And let's go, I think we're going to, some directions to something. I'll put that on the side just for now. And what in the world is this? All right, this is a stand-up sign holder. I have no clue exactly what it does. Oh, it is broken. Okay, so I guess it would like lean up like that. And the piece that kind of makes it stand up is sadly broken. Not really sure what I would do with that otherwise because it is broken. I have no idea. Maybe you guys can leave me a comment and give me an idea what I could do with it. But uh, I guess I'll sit that in the junk pile for now. I don't know. Maybe I'll do something with it. Maybe not. And looks like we may be an empty box. Yeah, sadly. I'm not really sure what this was supposed to go to. Um, packing list enclosed envelope. Sorry, definitely an empty box though, guys. Nothing inside of there. I don't know. Maybe I don't got a good feeling about this bag. But hopefully there's some stuff in here. Some kind of giant thing right here. No clue what this is. No. Guys, this thing, this is one of those, um... Like little boogie boards, it's kind of like, I don't know how to explain it. I'm going to show you guys. I found one of these before in Bed Bath & Beyond a long time ago. It looks like it might be broken though, guys. I don't know. Let's, let's try to take this out. Let me pause it real quick and try to take this out. All right, guys, I got this out of the packaging. Guys, it is seriously, it is not broken. And it even comes with, where did I put it? it even comes with an extra insert for the back. Um, you just put, oh, I put it underneath of there. You just put like these little black pieces on the back of it. Let me just show you exactly what it is. You guys probably already know, but if you don't, I'm going to show you what it is. It's called a blackboard. Um, so it's really, really cool, guys. Check this out. So pretty much you just kind of write on it just like that. Oh, there's another puppy. Anyway, just pretty much write on it like that, but it's like freaking magic watch. You just press this button right there and... It just vanishes. I have no idea. It does take like a little battery in the back. I just looked at anyway That's pretty much exactly what it does. I don't know it has a couple of buttons down here Maybe you guys can tell me what does uh, what that does I did find one a long long time ago It was not this fancy look and I think it was when they first came out, but this thing is flipping epic Definitely really excited about that. Let me go ahead and move this to the side really really cool find guys Oh, by the way, I did find the pen obviously That goes with it what is that in the back? I don't know why it looks like. Maybe it has an eraser on it, but I have no idea why we, you would need an eraser for that, but I don't know. Anyway, really cool find already, guys. Let's go ahead and get back inside. The, oh, my God. I think there's another one in here. Oh, there is. No way. Freaking jackpot, guys. Oh, my God. Let's see if it works. It's already like, uh, looks like it's already been like uh, scribbled on a little bit. Oh, it does work. Holy cow, guys. Freaking awesome. We got two of them already. I have no idea how expensive they are. I think the one that I found a long time ago was like 40 bucks. These look a little bit more fancy. They could be even more expensive. I doubt it, but probably like somewhere around 30 or 40 dollars, guys. Definitely already an amazing bag. Oh my god. It looks like we got a thing of Expro. Uh looks like they're probably what are they? Fluorescent wet erase markers. I don't know. Really cool. Definitely, they're all in there. There's nothing wrong with them at all. Still seal, guys. Awesome. Definitely going to keep them for sure. Um, all right. Got some, like, legs to something. Not really sure what they go to. Sit them to the side. And what in the world? All right. So there's another sign holder. 
It looks like it is completely smashed in half, so I'll add that to the junk pile over there. I'm thinking that these legs that we just found go to this. I'm not really sure what that is. Can you guys tell me, maybe? I have no idea, but I got like some sort of like little legs right there. It looks like possibly it goes to this. Not really sure, guys. What in the world is this? Oh, this is one of those, um... What do you guys call this? This is one of those guns that you put on tags for like, um, like t-shirts and stuff like that. Flipping awesome. That is really, really cool. I, I'm not really sure how to use it, but I don't know. I'm going to keep it anyway. Definitely awesome find. Oh, here is the, I don't think it's the whole piece, but it looks like it's a small portion of the sign holder. Sadly, it's definitely broken in half. Um, oh, a little hole punch. Sweet. Definitely looks like it's all intact. That was, that was, uh, that noise just breaking this little piece of paper on it. It's dot broken. And I don't know, guys. I think I've found like 300 of these inside this same dumpster before. And they honestly, they're never broken. I don't know why they're always thrown in there. But anyway, it looks like it's honestly pretty much it. Oh, here we go. We've got a job work order. I don't know. Some kind of like proposal forms or whatever. I guess I'll keep them. The front is torn a little bit. Not a big deal. I don't know. I thought there would have probably been more stuff inside this bag, but those are flipping awesome, guys. Found two of them. And sadly, there's another stand inside of here. I don't know. We got like three or four stands so far. They're all broken, guys. It looks like that is pretty much it. And there is like one thing sitting in the bottom of here. And it's sadly, it is empty, but it looks like it was some kind of... I have no idea what it is. It looks like a little mini heater or something like that. And it's not in there. I thought it would have been in there, honestly. Kind of excited for that. But, I don't know. Sadly, that is pretty much it, guys. And we got the little tote. So, really cool find. Definitely really cool with these things. I love these things. Awesome find, guys. So, anyway, that's pretty much it from the office supply store. A little pile of junk right here. I have no idea what this is at all. Um, yeah, not really sure. Probably just going to go ahead and toss that. And guys, I'll probably, let's go ahead and let's get inside of this gigantic flipping box. Huge jackpot. Oh my God, there's so many posters. I don't even know. I guess I'll just show you guys. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I don't want to pull every single one of them out. Oh, where are the emoji ones? I know I saw emoji ones that are freaking awesome. I don't know, guys, but I'll give you a quick glimpse. That is, I don't know, they're all abbreviated. I'm not going to go through every single one of them, but definitely really cool graphic posters. Some of them are emojis, which are flipping awesome. I cannot see right now. They're probably right in front of my face and somewhere in here. But, guys, humongous jackpot of posters. I think this is our second time finding a humongous jackpot of posters on, on camera. I'm not really sure. I think um, maybe an episode a long, long time ago, we found a bunch of posters again. Definitely really, really cool. Not really sure what I'll do with all of them, but I'll probably just give them away to, like, I don't know, kids around the neighborhood or whatever. No clue. I cannot find emoji posters, but you guys take my word on it. You guys probably saw it, and I just cannot find it. Anyway, bunch of posters in here, guys. So I'm not going to go through every single one of them. And that is pretty much it for um, the office supply store. Gigantic jackpot of posters, guys. And we have a humongous flipping bag from five full of probably, like, returns give you guys a quick little peek and what I'm trying to get to you guys is you're going to sorry to do this to you, you guys are going to have to tune in for tomorrow's episode guys because like I told you I'm filming this the next day and um when I upload this it's going to be the same day pretty much when I'm going through all this stuff and it is pouring down rain again guys outside I don't know it's just like 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 vice versa like in springtime it didn't rain at all but now in the fall time it's pouring down rain guys so you're going to have to tune in for tomorrow's episode because I'm not going to go out tonight. I'm going to save this gigantic jackpot bag from five for tomorrow's episode, guys. I'm sorry to do that to you. We still found some amazing stuff tonight, guys. So like I said, I am sorry about that. But like I said, it is raining. I have to have an episode for tomorrow. I'm not going to go out in the pouring down rain. It's like really, really pouring. It's not just drizzling. But anyway, guys, still found an awesome jackpot tonight. Tune in for tomorrow. Huge jackpot from five thank you all so much for tuning in it's gonna pretty much do it for tonight's episode say bye bb say bye all right guys like i said pretty much gonna do it for tonight's episode thank you all so much for tuning in today i hope you all enjoyed if you all enjoyed please give me a big thumbs up i greatly greatly appreciate that and if you guys are new to my channel guys please go ahead and hit that subscribe button guys because i'll be back tomorrow with a new episode